All right, welcome to part four of Fallout. That was the most traditional intro I think I've ever done. I would like a round of applause for that, actually. So, uh, we had the world's most arduous battle with the Rad Scorpion uh, before getting in here. So, I'm super thrilled about... Oh, great, there's more rats. Um, I'm super thrilled about actually getting into the vault proper. Um, and getting our water chip. So that's very exciting. Um, I'm sweating like a fucking dog because I don't have my fan on because uh, my room is already noisy because my computer makes hella background. <gasps> I'm unarmed. Fuck, I'm swinging. I'm swinging. I'm sw Fuck. <laughs> Holy shit. That was brutal shit. And, of course, nothing, right? Okay. So we definitely need to open up our inventory. Um, definitely rolling with the knife for this one. Um, two shots left, uh, which is fine. Uh, God, I'm so sweaty. Oh, fuck. <laughs> in case you wanted to know what was going on in my personal life uh, at this point in time. I'm sweating. Um, rat. Not wanted. Killing. I'm killing it. That's what I'm doing. Wow, apparently punching is, like, way fucking better. Oh, no. That's... The knife is an interesting weapon because it's, like, super RNG. Like, it's like, do you want to gamble? Maybe you do, maybe you don't. Whoa, what the fuck is that? What is that? I do not remember that thing. What is, what in God's green name is that? What the fuck is that? I'm going to miss this shot. I don't even care. Get me the... I can't even go back. There's fucking rats out here. What, what am I going to do? I, of course I missed. I had an 11% chance of hitting. All I know is I'm getting the fuck out of this place. Get the fuck out. What the fuck is this fucking... This was not... I swear to God, this was not in my last playthrough. I have no idea what this thing is. I'm still missing. I am fucked. Also, um, we should be able to put in more hollow points, right? Can I only load two? Oh, okay, that's weird. Um, okay, so we're reloaded. And that'll consume our Oh god, here he is! What the fuck is it? I how his, his nose and is rubbing my fucking crutch! How can you miss? How can you miss? How can you do it? I'm amazed! I am in awe of how you can miss this fucking thing. It's a mole rat. That's not that scary. I thought this was like a giant fucking bear or something. Okay. I want you to. What do I do? What do I do? What do I need to do? What do I need to do to you to make you hit this fucking thing? I. I. My agility. My agility is good. My agility is good. My journey's good. What are you doing this? Oh! <laughs> I can't. No, I'm sorry. This is so, so bullshit. No, 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 no. I'm not accepting that. I'm sorry. I am not accepting that. I can't. I cannot accept this. I can't. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That something in the fucking code got fucked up that's all i know i'm sorry that is absolutely not gonna happen absolutely not gonna fucking happen okay get fucked little kid oh god you dumbass how are these all for one point i swear to god i my bones are like broken or something i have no idea how i can miss a gunshot where he's literally as far away from me as i am from the mic right now and miss my fucking knife attacks that many times and when i do hit the knife attack it's one damage like do i have osteoporosis i don't fucking understand this shit god and i, I just, just i just all I want is for you to not- You just don't have to miss! I'm begging you! 
You can hit! I swear you can! You have my permission to hit your fucking targets! God! Holy shit! What is up with this? Okay, here comes the big boy. Oh God! How? Oh, I thought I hit that. Oh my God! Let's move out here again. This this is the old strat now. I think we yeah I think we need to go back to the old uh, the old strat against the rad scorpion. Just take a shot and then run the fuck away. He missed you, bitch. Oh, it's not even worth it. He only did five damage. Like, what am I supposed to do with five damage? I'm, I just, I'm wondering if my knife would be better at this point. Like, I figured the pistol would be more consistent, but I can't even fucking hit a shot. The only reason I didn't want to walk out here is because I don't want to trigger those rats to join this thing in combat. But I think I might be able to get away with this. It's better than getting hit twice every turn. This game is fucking brutal, I'll tell you that much. I don't even have any more stim packs. Like, if there's any more monsters in this thing, I'm absolutely fucked. Ah! Oh! It's dead. Oh my god. Okay. They, you don't have anything? Oh my god. I officially despise this game. It's it's now on record as being despised by me personally. That is this is some hot bullshit. We're gonna save though. We earned that. Um definitely gonna change this all right there we go you notice that there's a wall locker on the east wall just like in your own vault well how fucking precious I'm trying not to die Martha the vent is very damaged and cannot be repaired the display screens in this bank of monitors have been damaged beyond repair this isn't a good sign the computer is broken. Everything's fucking broken, and you're expecting me to waltz in here like, oh, hey, here's the computer water chip that's definitely not broken like everything else is. The monitor is worthless with a broken display screen. Now, the furthest I've ever gotten in this game, spoilers, is that you get into Vault 15, and then you need a rope to get down the elevator to get to the actual water chip. Uh, yeah, that's the farthest I've ever gotten. And then, I, like I said, I went back to, like, Sandy Shores or whatever it's called for a little, and then it didn't work. But, yeah, so that being said... As you can tell, I don't have very much experience in this game at all, so that's really good. Elevator shaft. The elevator shaft is not easily descended without a rope. Okay, well, there you go. I spoiled, like, two minutes away. I see a bed. The bed is in pretty bad condition. Okay. So, yeah, this vault's totally fucked up beyond repair, and uh, we need to get a rope. And this is the farthest I've ever gone, actually. So, uh, let's get out of here, eh? What a fucking nightmare this whole event has been. Oh, God, you would. You would, you little bitch rat. You fucking would. I don't even want to use this. I wanted to do that. It's over. It is finished. Oh, God. This is some bad shit. Let's get up the ladder. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Let's go back to that town that I can't remember the name of. Alright, what do you got for me? Oh god, I swear to god if there's another fucking... Oh, we made it. Oh, we made it. Unknown. Welcome to Shady Sands, stranger. Please holster that weapon while you're here. Um, alright, does that mean, uh, put it away? I can do that. 
Don't worry about it, amigos. I got you. I'll put on my tool and my flare. Matter of fact. Oh, it's so nice to see civilization. Oh! <laughs> okay. Let's... To the south, you see an adobe wall surrounding a peaceful-looking village. It is a peaceful-looking village. Let's have a let's let's have a bird's eye view of what's going on here. This is Shady Sands. There's uh, four buildings. It looks like uh, five buildings. Yeah, five beautiful buildings and an obelisk because they're Egyptians. What is that? Is that a mongrel? That's a dog. I can't talk to him though. Let's talk to this guy, Seth, leader of the guards of Shady Sands. Good day. I am called Seth. How can I help you? Well, I'd like some information. Um, information. What do you want to know about? Well, I want to know about this place. Thanks for being more specific, buddy. Shady Sands is a peaceful community. We have our own irrigation system so we can grow our own food. If we were not plagued with raiders and rad scorpions, uh, I know the fucking feeling, uh, we would have no problems. Oh, God, please don't make me get involved with raiders and rad scorpions. I have, like, rad scorpion PTSD at this point. I want to know about the rad scorpions. Those damn rad scorpions have been after our Brahmins since we moved here. Not a week goes by that someone doesn't get poisoned trying to keep them out of the pants. Last week they took down my brother Jarvis. Roslo, I don't... Oh, I'm not... I'm not done. Roslo, our doctor, is looking for an antidote as quickly as he can. Hey, if you have the means to help us, why don't you talk to our leader, Aridesh? Oh, I don't... I'm, trust, believe you me. I... In no circumstances have the means to help you. I'm sorry that I just bumped the mic and you might have heard that. Uh, I, but I, you can trust me when I say you are infinitely better equipped to handle this rad scorpion problem than me. Um, take me to the rad scorpion caves. Ah, I want to know about this place. Um, tell me about the raiders. Um, there are several groups of raiders. I organize guards like Ian to help fight them off. There's one band to the southeast of here. Watch out for them. That's wonderful of you. Thank you. Um, I need to go back here, actually. I just need to put in the towns that I visited. Okay. Organized guards like Ian to help fight them off. There's one band to the southeast of here. Watch out for them. One band to the southeast. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely not going to the Rad Scorpion Caves. I appreciate the concern. You should speak to Aridesh, our leader. He likes to meet all of our visitors. He should be in our town hall, the building to the south. Thank you. Uh, which I'm guessing... What, what is south? Isn't this all south? That's okay. Um, uh, God, I'm so uninterested in dealing with rad scorpions right now. I'm so over it. Weather vane. This simple weather vane helps the people of Shady Sands study the weather. What do you got for me? I am unarmed. Please put your weapon away. Oh. Why should I? This looks like a dangerous world. Normally, I would agree with you. It's very dangerous to travel unarmed, but this is Shady Sands and we are peaceful people. There's no need for weapons here. This is... It's a fucking flare. Oh, it is... Dam it does do damage. Okay. Oh, my God. He does damage with the tool, too. I think... Nah, it's just unarmed. Okay, what do you got for me? Welcome to Shady Sands, Traveler. My name is Katrina. My job is to greet strangers and help them understand our village. We find that there are fewer problems if you listen to what I have to say. Okay. Um, uh, well, tell me, tell me more about yourself. What, what, what's, what's going on here? My life was very boring. I was raised in a vault. I lived there for many years. Unfortunately, we were crowded, and life was very bad. There was a schism. Oh, oh god damn it! Stop doing that. There was a schism, and many people left, uh, taking with them the best equipment. Still, some of us tried to stay in the vault. But then we were attacked. I was hurt and I ended up here. Now I try to help people. Okay. Holy shit, there are entirely too many dialogue options right now. There are so many dialogue options. What should I do if I get hurt? Well, if you can't get to a doctor, you will need to heal yourself. Well, I mean, if I had stim packs, that'd be great. Stim packs are a common healing item. Use them on yourself to heal minor, cure minor wounds. I'm sorry, I keep hitting the fucking mic. I'm not used to it being right, right in front of me. Um, first aid is a slower method, but it is always available. For major wounds, like a broken leg, you will need to use doctor skill. I can always do first aid. I'm going to have to look at that. Um, doctor skill. I think my doctor skill is not very good. Um, where can I get some better equipment? You'll have to do like we do. Scavenge it or trade for it. And if you are attacked, your foes might provide equipment if you live long enough to loot them. 
We are a peaceful community, so we mostly barter or trade for the items we cannot produce. Tell me more about bartering. All right. Bartering is the exchange of goods. You give me some items, and I give you some items of trade. Since you initiated the barter, I will let you pick and choose what you want, but the deal must be one that I think I will like. So you probably want to give me more valuable goods that you don't need in exchange for less expensive things that you want. And if you don't have enough items to trade, there are always caps. Bottle caps are the only common money. Oh. Oh, there we go. Found out here. The caps are backed by the merchants of the hub, so you can trade them anywhere. All right. Well, we're going to learn more about uh, about this place. Uh, we'll go ahead and keep talking with... I forgot her name. Shit, I'm sorry. We're going to keep talking with her when we get back in the next episode, and then we'll uh, see what's going on and uh, go from there. So... That's all for now. Thanks. Mm -hmm.